the Andromeda Galaxy, the closest spiral galaxy to the Milky Way. At a distance of around 2.5 million light years, and our largest cosmic neighbour. Under good conditions, and without technical aids, it is the most distant object that can be observed with the naked eye. More than 130 years have passed since the very first photograph of the Andromeda Galaxy was taken by the British amateur astronomer Isaac Roberts. Since then, the galaxy, also known as Messier 31, has become one of the most photographed deep sky objects. Thanks to modern digital sensors, the quality of astronomical images has improved at a tremendous pace. Until a few years ago, Messier 31 was photographed almost entirely with broadband filters to capture the light of the entire visible spectrum. But ambitious astrophotographers have increasingly turned to exposing the galaxy with line filters, such as a hydrogen alpha filter. This showed the hydrogen 2 regions and the star forming regions in the galaxy's spiral arms. Like a string of pearls, the red nebulae of ionized hydrogen line up one after the other. Each of these nebulae, dozens to hundreds of light years in diameter, are the birthplace of new young stars. But it is not only the Andromeda galaxy itself that contains the stuff stars are made of. The red glowing hydrogen can also be found in the interstellar medium of the Milky Way. However, the concentration of the gases is incredibly low. Enormous exposure times, however, make it possible to visualize the fine hydrogen clouds that are located far in the foreground of Messier 31. These are in the Milky Way itself. The Andromeda galaxy now appears almost transparent and weightless. Its spiral arms appear like rings of fire and extend in multiple rings far into the outer reaches of the giant galaxy. At this high exposure time, fainter structures such as supernova remnants and tiny planetary nebulae appear alongside the star-forming regions. Increasingly powerful sensors and more sophisticated filters have encouraged astrophotographers to experiment. It was only a matter of time before amateurs first captured the light of Messier 31's ionized oxygen, the so-called O3 line. The result is dramatic. The turquoise glowing light of the O3 line is found in all spiral arms and far beyond the galactic disk. Tiny turquoise dots, far from the galactic centre, reveal Andromeda's most distant supernova remnants and planetary nebulae. When hydrogen and oxygen wavelengths are combined, Andromeda is revealed in a, an impressive blaze of colour, showing details that have never been seen before. Like this flower-shaped nebula, shining in O3, which has incredible dimensions of the small Magellanic cloud. Or this pillar, measuring many thousands light years, and which seems to rise from the core of the Andromeda galaxy. Many known and unknown supernova remnants are also now clearly visible with a combination of wavelengths. But the galaxy has kept one secret for a very long time. In August 2022, our team made a surprising discovery. To this day, astronomers, amateur astronomers and astrophotographers have worked to confirm the existence of a new feature to the Andromeda galaxy. 
we are very pleased to present to you today the M3103 emission arc. The nature of the emission arc is still unclear. It could be a segment of a galactic supernova remnant or a bright part of an ancient galactic planetary nebula. However, the researchers in the team think two other scenarios are more likely. In one, the arc is in close proximity to M31. It is formed by massive interactions of stellar and tidal streams due to galactic mergers around M31. In the other scenario, the arc is located halfway between us and M31 and is an interaction shock of the Milky Way's galactic halos with that of M31. This discovery was possible because amateurs and professional scientists worked hand in hand. There was a lively exchange across numerous national borders and languages. Many months of intensive research, analysis and photography were necessary to be able to announce this discovery. We would like to thank all those involved in this exciting project and who supported the team. Thank you very much. <laughs>